any singer will tell you how important it is to have a great conductor, uh, a great arranger, and a great pianist. And I'm lucky to have all three. And his name, ladies and gentlemen, is Dave Grusin. I just feel tremendous gratitude for all of my teachers, all of my mentors, and certainly to Dave Grusin for allowing me to tell his story. Coming from a small town in the Midwest, Boulder was just seen as a mecca and the coolest place on earth. After I graduated from CU, I taught high school for a couple years in Denver, and then I decided, you know, before I get any older, I need to go to LA and have a career in singing, and then eventually ended up at the new Mickey Mouse Club TV show on the Disney Channel, where I was a music producer and um, ended up choosing people like Justin Timberlake, Britney Spears, Ryan Gosling, these really wonderful child stars that have gone on to become very famous. So after that I moved to Santa Fe, New Mexico. My first short film was about high school reunions titled Should You Go? Then I've done the Dave Grusin film and now I'm on my fourth documentary about a sculptor named Kevin Box who lives in Santa Fe. Dave is just one of my favorite human beings on this planet. That's Dave Grusin and it was like talking about a kind of godlike figure in the world of music. A 60-year career in music, film, and television, nobody has a bad thing to say about Dave Grusin. The tremendous output that he's had, his incredible respect within the industry, it just really fits with my life mission to create films that are inspiring. We've been in about 16 festivals at this point and we're actually winning awards. I've been sort of shocked because people have even been moved to tears and I am truly grateful to everyone that has been a part of this process even going way back to the University of Colorado in 1980. I wanted to give back to the college for what it gave to me. I think the next hundred years music is going to continue growing in its importance because in this highly fast-paced technological world we need to have balance and we need to connect to our humanity. So music connects us on an emotional and a spiritual, a physical even level and I think that we need it more than we ever did.